hello guys today i am going to teach you how to make homing missile so please select a 2d project and name it homing missile and create project okay so now first of all we create a folder name sprites and i already have a sprite for this project you can find it on google or make it by yourself press drag and drop a ufo sprite on the screen Set a scale to 0.3.3 and uh, and apply a rigid body 2D on it and make it kinematic. Okay. Now create another folder name scripts. Create a new script for our UFO movement. Okay. Okay, so this is our script for our UFO. And now create a public rigid body to the named RV. Okay, and then add a public function and add down RV dot. Okay, so now oh, uh, I forgot to assign uh, the rigid body. Okay, so and also the script and drag and drop our rigid body on it. Now we can see the UFO is move uh, with our mouse pointer. Okay, so let's stop. Now we need to create our missile. Okay, make it a smaller or oh, too small. Set it to okay. okay, now add a rigid body 2D on it and uh, make the grip T scale to zero. Okay. 
okay and uh, now create a new script new c sharp script and uh, michelle okay and open it okay so now first of all we create uh, Public transform target. Okay. Assign the target and now again. Oh, sorry, we need to create a private repository. Now, on a start function. Are we equal to get component create body to the okay? Then we need to create a fit subject function. Fix subject function. Include a speed with it and create a public float value for speed of five. You can increase this later. Okay. Now we check. You can see the. Our missile is going upwards. Okay, so now we need to target the UFO. Okay, so in update function, in fixed update function, we are going to change something. Vector to direction is equal to. Okay, now we create a float float is count it is something like a, a product of two vectors a cross product of two vectors
now we need to assign angular velocity Okay, so now we need to create another float. Okay, so now we need maybe oh. And now we just uh, minus right. and we need to normalize the direction so we add line uh, okay hopefully now our Missile will work. Yes, it is working. You can see. Now you can change the speed and the rotation speed uh, according to your need. And uh, if you copy uh, it uh, and make more missiles. They will do the same. Okay. Hopefully, you like this tutorial. Please subscribe my channel and like this video. If you have any problem regarding this tutorial or any other YouTube problem, please comment below. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, sorry, I forgot to destroy this missile. So we just delete other and work on the same missile we apply a trigger enter And also need to instantiate. Okay, explosion. On the same position. Okay, so now we need to create a public game object. Named explosion. Okay, so now we import a uh, explosion package from your DSS store. Unity particle pack. Import all the assets. Okay, so now we are creating a collider. We use uh, Polygon Collider 2D and don't forget to check the this button is trigger enter 
and now we also need to plug a collider on our UFO box collider and adjust the size Oops, sorry okay so Nice effect. Okay, so now our tutorial is ended, and thank you so much for watching this tutorial. Hopefully, it will help. Please subscribe my channel and like this video.